Real causes of vertical ridges. Your nails indicate the overall health of your body. Nails, those protective layers covering the tips of our fingers and toes, are actually made up of a protein called keratin. As new cells grow, they push older cells out, resulting in the formation of the hard surface we recognize as our nails. But what exactly constitutes healthy nails? Healthy nails are typically smooth, with a pinkish hue and a consistent texture. They should be free from discoloration, ridges, or unusual markings. Nails can come in a range of colors and textures, each telling a story about our body's internal health. For example, pale or bluish nails may indicate poor circulation, while yellowing can be a sign of fungal infection or even more serious conditions like liver disease. Brittle or splitting nails might suggest a deficiency in essential nutrients, such as vitamins, minerals, or proteins. So in this video, we explore the seven main causes of vertical ridges on the fingernails and why this happens, including vitamin B12, iron deficiency, plant-based diets, digestive problems, thyroid problems. So let's start with first cause, anemia. Vertical ridges in your nails can be a sign of anemia, a condition where your body doesn't have enough healthy red blood cells. These red blood cells carry oxygen, and when you're anemic, your nails may not get what they need to grow smoothly. This can cause ridges along the length of your nails. Anemia can also make your nails weak and brittle. However, nail ridges aren't a definitive sign of anemia. To be sure, watch for other symptoms like fatigue, pale skin, shortness of breath, dizziness, cold hands and feet, rapid heartbeat, or headaches. If you experience several of these along with the nail ridges, see a doctor. A blood test can diagnose anemia and determine the cause, allowing for proper treatment. Cause number second is nutrient deficiencies. Vertical ridges on your nails can sometimes be a sign of nutrient deficiencies. Our bodies rely on a variety of vitamins and minerals for healthy nail growth. When we lack sufficient amounts of certain nutrients, the nail plate can become weak and develop these ridges. Now we will know about some essential nutrients and we'll also know which diseases can be caused by their deficiency. Iron. Iron is a crucial mineral for transporting oxygen throughout the body, and it also plays a role in nail growth. Deficiency can lead to vertical ridges and brittle nails. Biotin. This B vitamin is essential for keratin production, a protein that forms the building blocks of nails. A lack of biotin can cause ridges splitting and thinning of the nails. Zinc. Zinc plays a vital role in cell division and protein synthesis, both of which are necessary for healthy nail growth. Deficiency can manifest as vertical ridges, white spots, and slow nail growth. Protein. Protein is another essential building block for nails. If you don't consume enough protein, your nails may become weak and develop ridges. Essential fatty acids. These fats are crucial for maintaining overall skin and nail health. Deficiency can lead to dry, brittle nails with ridges. Now we move to the cause number third, da thyroid disease. Vertical ridges in your nails can sometimes be a sign of an underlying thyroid condition, particularly hypothyroidism. The thyroid gland is a butterfly-shaped organ located in your neck that plays a vital role in regulating your body's metabolism. It produces hormones that control various functions, including cell growth and repair. When your thyroid is underactive, hypothyroidism, it doesn't produce enough thyroid hormones, leading to a slowdown in many bodily processes. This slowdown can also affect your nail growth. Now the question arises that, how does hypothyroidism affect our nails? We try to know the answer to this in three parts. Let's start with the first part. Reduced cell turnover. Thyroid hormones are responsible for stimulating cell turnover throughout the body, including the nail bed. In hypothyroidism, the slower cell turnover can lead to a buildup of older cells in the nail plate, manifesting as vertical ridges. Brittle nails. The lack of sufficient thyroid hormones can also disrupt the production of keratin, a protein that gives nails their strength and flexibility. This can result in nails that are weak, 
brittle, and prone to breaking. Slowed nail growth. The overall slowdown in body functions caused by hypothyroidism can also affect the rate of nail growth. You might notice that your nails grow slower than usual when you have an underactive thyroid. Our fourth cause is Raynaud's disease. Vertical ridges on your nails can be a potential indicator of Raynaud's phenomenon, a condition that affects blood circulation in the fingers and toes. Raynaud's causes the blood vessels in these extremities to narrow in response to cold temperatures or emotional stress. This narrowing restricts blood flow, leading to a variety of symptoms, including discoloration of the fingers and toes. Interestingly, it can also impact nail health. When Raynaud's episodes occur, the restricted blood flow can limit the supply of oxygen and nutrients to the nail bed. This limited supply can disrupt the normal growth process of the nails, potentially leading to the formation of vertical ridges. The compromised blood flow caused by Raynaud's can also affect the production of keratin, the protein responsible for nail strength. This can result in nails that are weak and brittle and more prone to developing ridges. It's important to note that vertical ridges on their own are not a definitive sign of Raynaud's disease. Many other factors can cause them. Discoloration of fingers and toes. During an episode, your fingers and toes may turn white or blue due to the lack of blood flow. As blood flow returns, they may turn red and feel tingly or throbbing. Numbness or tingling. You might experience numbness or tingling sensations in your fingers and toes, particularly during episodes pain in fingers and toes. In severe cases, Raynaud's episodes can cause pain in the affected areas. Cause number fifth is lichen planus vertical ridges in your nails can sometimes be a sign of lichen planus, an autoimmune disease that affects the skin, hair, and sometimes the nails. In lichen planus, the immune system mistakenly attacks healthy tissue. When it affects the nails, it can cause a variety of changes including vertical ridges. Lichen planus can cause inflammation in the nail matrix, the area responsible for nail growth. This inflammation disrupts the normal growth process, leading to the formation of vertical ridges on the nail plate. Surface irregularities. The inflammation can also affect the surface of the nail plate, causing it to become rough, pitted, or develop uneven ridges. Other nail changes. In addition to vertical ridges, Lichen planus can cause other nail changes such as thinning, splitting, discoloration, often becoming reddish-brown near the cuticle, and separation of the nail from the nail bed. While vertical ridges can be a symptom of lichen planus, it's important to note that they are not specific to this condition. Other factors can also cause them. Additionally, lichen planus typically presents with other symptoms beyond just nail changes. Here are some additional signs to watch for violet-colored, itchy bumps on the skin, often on the wrists, forearms, ankles, lower back, or genitals, lacy white lines on the inside of the cheeks, Wickham striae's hair loss, especially from the scalp or areas where the bumps appear, difficulty chewing or swallowing due to inflammation in the mouth, cause number sixth is dehydration. Vertical ridges in your nails can sometimes be a temporary indicator of dehydration. Our bodies rely on adequate water intake for various functions, including maintaining healthy skin, hair, and nails. When you're dehydrated, your body doesn't have enough fluids to keep these tissues optimally hydrated. This lack of hydration can impact the health and appearance of your nails, including promoting the development of vertical ridges. Dehydration can lead to a decrease in the water content of the nails making them dry and brittle. This dryness can disrupt the normal structure of the nail plate, causing it to become uneven and more prone to developing vertical ridges. Dehydration can also slow down the rate of nail growth. As the nail cells don't have sufficient moisture, their growth and division may be hampered, potentially leading to the appearance of ridges. While vertical ridges can be a sign of dehydration, it's important to remember that they can also be caused by other factors. Increased thirst. This is the most common symptom of dehydration. You may feel constantly thirsty, even after drinking fluids. Decreased urination. You may urinate less frequently, 
and in smaller amounts when dehydrated. Dark colored urine. Your urine may appear dark yellow or amber colored due to the concentration of waste products. Fatigue and tiredness. Dehydration can zap your energy levels and make you feel tired. Dry mouth and lips. You may experience dryness in your mouth and have chapped lips. Headache. Dehydration can sometimes cause headaches. Dizziness. You might feel lightheaded or dizzy, especially when standing up quickly. Now we move to the last and seventh cause is skin conditions. Vertical ridges in your nails can sometimes be associated with underlying skin conditions such as eczema and psoriasis. These conditions affect the skin and can sometimes extend to the nail unit, which includes the nail plate, nail bed, and cuticle. When a skin condition disrupts the health of the nail unit, it can manifest in various changes, including the development of vertical ridges. Now we to know how skin conditions affect nails. Inflammation. Skin conditions like eczema and psoriasis often involve inflammation. When this inflammation affects the nail bed, it can disrupt the growth process of the nail plate, leading to the formation of vertical ridges. Impaired nail development. The inflammation caused by these skin conditions can also impair the proper development of the nail cells. This can result in an uneven nail plate with ridges along its surface. Secondary nail changes. In some cases, the skin condition itself might cause physical changes around the nail that indirectly affect ridge formation. For example, eczema around the nail folds can lead to swelling and pressure on the nail plate, potentially contributing to ridges. While vertical ridges can be a sign of a skin condition, it's important to note that they are not specific to these conditions. Many other factors can also cause them. Furthermore, skin conditions affecting the nails typically present with other visual changes beyond just ridges. Here are some signs to watch for. Eczema. Dry, itchy, red, and inflamed patches of skin, often on the hands, face, elbows, knees, or feet. Small fluid-filled bumps may also appear. Psoriasis, thick red, scaly patches of skin that may be covered with silvery white scales. These patches can appear on the scalp, elbows, knees, lower back, and nails. It's important to understand that while certain natural supplements can promote overall nail health, there's no guaranteed solution to specifically address vertical ridges. These ridges can have various causes, and addressing the underlying issue is often the best course of action. However, some natural supplements may be helpful in improving overall nail health and potentially reducing the appearance of ridges. Here are three options to consider. Biotin. Biotin is a B vitamin that plays a crucial role in keratin production. Keratin is a protein that forms the building blocks of hair, skin, and nails. A deficiency in biotin can lead to weak, brittle nails with ridges, including biotin-rich foods like eggs, Nuts and avocados in your diet, or taking a biotin supplement can be beneficial. Fish oil. Fish oil is a rich source of omega-3 fatty acids, which are essential for maintaining overall skin and nail health. These fatty acids help keep nails hydrated and flexible, potentially reducing the appearance of ridges. You can get omega-3s from fatty fish like salmon, tuna, and sardines, or consider taking a fish oil supplement. Horsetail extract. Horsetail extract is a herbal supplement that contains silica, a mineral that may contribute to nail strength. While research on its effectiveness for nail health is limited, some studies suggest it might be beneficial. However, horsetail can interact with certain medications and may not be suitable for everyone. It's crucial to consult with your doctor before using horsetail extract, especially if you have any health concerns. If you like this video, please like and share the video and subscribe to the channel. Thank you.